All right, we got our screwdriver and trusty wrench. This guy is coming in a lot more use than I thought it would be. Oh, hey, you're back for part three. This steampunk dragon has been quite the build so far with all of its unique twists and, of course, trying to figure out the instructions. Uh, if you're building along with me at home today, this next set of instructions is very interesting. And there's one thing I want to talk about right away that will make everything a lot easier for us as we're trying to go forward. This is that mini screwdriver that came in our kit. And if we take a screw when we're trying to align all of our pieces, and we actually work our way with a screwdriver on the opposite end of where our screw will go in, what we can do is once our screwdriver is in, we can take our screw and push it, and then we can push our screwdriver out and place our screw in. This makes it a lot easier for us to be able to line up some of these pieces, especially when we're trying to be able to put these little brass guys inside some of our joints. Just something to keep in mind to make this whole process a little bit easier. Remember guys, this is not a rush. We wanna take our time with this build. There's a lot here to do as you'll see in the next few steps. All right, I've said enough. I have all my pieces here ready to go, and if you do too, let's go ahead and get started.